Good afternoon and welcome. I'm Jason Bennett. We're coming to you from RSEA Park. We're set for an enthralling contest between St Kilda and Fremantle. Exposed form suggests that these two sides may both be contenders this season. They're both in the top four and both playing impressive football. Now it's time for the players to take to the field. Alongside Kelly Underwood. Hello, Kel. What are you looking forward to today? Pleasure to be here, Jason. I'm going to have to go with the Dockers. This will be close. Both sides have started the season strongly and will obviously be looking to continue to bank premiership points and build momentum. An interesting perspective. Thanks, Kelly. The umpire and the two captains are ready for the toss. There were some interesting things said during the week, but the time for talk is over. Strom wins the first ruck contest. Miller reads the tap well. Loose ball on centre wing and will have a throw in. Daniel Harford is here. Half, what are your thoughts on what we've seen so far? There's a bit of niggle in this one early. A couple of players already unhappy with some attention off the ball. Strom with a deft tap. Bowers will be important as always. Friend, she's set upon. McKinnon has marked in front of goal. It's one of those ones that should be kicked, but it's amazing how often players miss them. This would be a great start, but it's gone wide. Those are the kinds of opportunities you need to take. Back into play. Stannett with a chance to run. They'll bide their time. The Dockers are out of trouble. Ignoring the corridor for now, Ott belts it clear. McDonald navigated the traffic. McKinnon takes the hand pass. The kick was misdirected. Can she find a teammate? No one can mark. Antonio has a paddock in front of her. Hide. This is great ball movement. Can she deliver? You back her more often than not. She doesn't miss many of these, and she hasn't missed that one. She had the opportunity to put them in front, and that's exactly what she's done. Lovely finish. The Dockers on the board first. McKinnon gets her hand to it. White inside 50 with the kick. Disappointing footy there. Some indirect ball movement here. Miller with a chance to relieve the pressure. Runnels. Seth working hard and presenting well. The Dockers showing some good signs early. Bowers. She doesn't waste many. Defence 101 there. Veria. That's an aggressive handball. Takes on the responsibility. Just needs to finish. And finish she does. The Saints are on the back foot. That was possibly a bit too easy. The Dockers are up for this. It's a great start. McKinnon wins it out of the centre. White, Vesely. She's lost possession. Zenos. She's drawn a crowd. Antonio throws it on the boot. Ty gets to the front spot. Relatively straightforward kick, but that's easy to say from here. Set sail for home and delivers. She kicks with excellent technique and composure and that one was never going to miss. The Dockers have well and truly got the jump now. 
McKinnon showing her skills. White knew the tackle was coming. Couldn't find a way through. She's not one to take a backward step. That's not 15. McDonald. Stannett clears the area. The Dockers are playing some great footy. Low. Searching kick. Hyde. Keen to get the ball moving. Runnels. You can see their confidence growing. Punched away. Going at her first, and she's got it. She's a terrific asset with her pace and skills, and that was another example. Well, starts don't come much more impressive than this. Strom slaps it out. Runnels. It's a tough game. They need to hit the scoreboard here. Dreiser. That's good work rate. Who's at home? Here's a big chance to peg back the margin. It's not a gimme goal, but certainly one that should be kicked. You'd think she'd kick this. Oh, but you'd think wrong. Well, you can't afford to dwell on it. Just got to make sure you get the next one. Back into play. Pugh works hard to present. The Dockers are white hot at the moment. Seth lays it off. Veria in the right spot. Their ball movement has been impressive. Good thinking and good execution too. By hand. Antonio. The Saints. A chasing tail. Webb. Dangerous to leave her on her own. Clever kick. Ott takes a potentially goal-saving mark on the last line of defence. Doesn't often waste it. No one can mark. And out of play. The Saints are struggling to provide their forwards with quality supply. It might be time to shuffle the magnets. McKinnon gets her hand to it. They've got a good understanding, those two. Zenos, what can she do with it? White absorbs the pressure. Anderson delivers a long ball. Punched away. Danger averted, frantic defence. Cuthbertson goes towards half-back. As Dennis would say, that kick was certainly to perfect. Stannett normally delivers low. The Dockers have started well. Rue in the clear on centre wing. The Saints guarding the corridor. Hyde met solidly. Fantastic tackling technique there. McKinnon wins it down. Terrific tackle. Antonio, Hyde. That's a legal disposal, isn't it? She's in trouble. That must be holding the ball. Her field kicking is normally first rate. Smith fumbles it. Attracted a crowd. Antonio, great body work. The Dockers have come to play and are threatening to open up a decent gap on the scoreboard. She's not going to waste an opportunity like that one. A few heads will start to drop soon. If they can't turn the tide, they're on the edge. The Dockers have got it on their terms here. Great ruck work. Dylan, can she hit a target? Stannett with the big fist. Rue, cop some unwanted attention. Patrikios, desperate to win it back. Shearlaw, marks inside 50 and can have a shot. The Saints with a late chance. Drop punt, and she has put it away. She could kick a bag today if the delivery continues to be that good. They've broken the run of goals at the other end, but they need a run of their own now. McKinnon palmed it down beautifully. Dylan, that's a bruising tackle. Another goal, and they'll believe. Good work rate. Nolder, marks. Will she go the bomb? The Saints, not at their best so far. Shearlaw read it well and claims the mark. Forwards dream of these shots. Bangs it through. She's causing all sorts of problems for them. They might need to make a change already. The Saints were on the rack. It's been a quality response from them. Rucks go at it. White, Dylan. Momentum has shifted. Stannett tries to spike it out of the danger zone. She's on song today, but she's missed this one. It seemed like the defenders got a little bit lost there and they were lucky not to give up a goal. Away she goes. Seth goes towards half-back. 
Strong grab. Takes a beauty. The Dockers look sharp early. No one can mark. And out it goes. McKinnon wins it. Patrikios. McDonald. Read it well. Intercepted it on centre wing. Veria. She's wrapped up. The Dockers with the early advantage. They're up and about, but the challenge will come. Half's back. What caught your eye, half? The Saints won plenty of the ball in that first quarter. In fact, they're leading the clearance count, but they undid some of their good work with sloppy disposal. If they can combine both elements, they'll be very confident they can win this game. I'm inclined to agree. Thanks, half. Strom punches it out of the ruck. Dylan, how will the umpire see this? McDonald delivers it inside 50. Pugh cuts it off. She's generally a good kick. Seth. She might have thought about the corridor. Wheelstra on centre wing. Veria crosses the arc. Runnels marks it centre half forward. They're playing with purpose and composure. Bowers has pushed deep and can have a shot. To really stamp some authority on this match. She's a good set shot and she's buried that one. If she wasn't such a big ball winner, she'd make a very decent forward. She's certainly got great goal sense. The Saints will be hearing alarm bells right about now. White, Zenos, out wide with the kick. Patrikios has brought her own ball. They desperately need this. She's missed. Some good work to create that shot on goal, but unfortunately the finish just let them down. Seth tasked with the kick in. Stanett can keep it moving. The Dockers playing like winners. Low. What a game she's having. Miller. What she got on offer. Thumped away and they see it out. Down at ground level, half. The Dockers look more dangerous going forward, and I think they're working a bit harder as well. Strom with a deft tap. Miller. The Saints on the ball now. Good looking kick. They've opened them up here. Can she be the fire starter? White. Picking their way through. Smith. Clever handball. She's lost it. Run down. Great chase. Going for territory. McKinnon takes an excellent grab. Happy to be patient and wait for an opening. White, good kick. Nolda dishes it off. They're a big chance here. Unable to get it inside 50. Goes very wide. Stanett, probing ball. Low. Heads towards half forward. That passage of play promised more. They'll be disappointed. White, she's kicked it high. Shearlaw, slick hands. Smith gets her kick despite the heat. Franklin is there in defence. Goes wide. Stanett pushes into space and receives the footy. The Dockers look well drilled. Quality delivery by foot. She just keeps racking up disposals. Low. That'll go close to the line. Runnels. The Saints have denied them the corridor. Miller all on her own. This deserves a goal. McKinnon wins it back. Great mark. Tumbles a punt towards the boundary line. Strom belts it clear. And a moment for the players to catch their breath. Half, what have you noticed down at ground level? There's often a correlation between winning the clearance count and winning on the scoreboard. That's not the case at the moment. White, she ran into a brick wall. Nolder, she's besieged. McKinnon, Smith, stripped of the footy. Solid tackle. Bowers, that might attract a pack. Good disciplined defence. Ty, useful hand pass. They cannot keep her quiet. Thumped away. Antonio. Not a lot of space to work in. Desperate defence. White. Dylan. She's been busy so far. Shearlaw. Takes the logical option. Zenos. McKinnon. 100% effort. It's no place for the faint-hearted. Oh, that has to hurt. Strom in the centre square. East. Big ball to be won here. Punched away. White. Has it on a string. Thought her way through it. Runnels got a fist in. Nolder, a oh, good tackle. McKinnon, Smith, 
Can she impose herself on the match? Hurried kick goes very wide. That's a bit of a waste. This might be a chance for the High Flyers. McKinnon belts it clear. Low, Miller. She's so clean with the footy. Strom. Kicks to space. Runnels. Kicks to half forward. Low. Feeds it out. Miller. They're moving the football quickly. Ty. She's going for home. And why wouldn't she with a finish like that? I think this margin is more or less reflective of the difference in class between these sides so far. The Saints have to respond now. It's getting away from them. McKinnon wins the hit out. Dylan. Zenos. Will the umpire pluck a free kick? Guttridge. She'll be sore tomorrow. White. Looking to pull one back. That's exactly what she's done. Well played. It eases the pressure on the forwards when you have midfielders chipping in. The Saints are just hanging in there, but they need to string some goals together. Miller. Bowers. Now it's someone else's problem. Veria gets the kick away. Fitzpatrick with a terrific mark deep in defence. The Dockers forcing them out wide. What can they muster from the back half? It's one for the high flyers. Can't take it. McDonald. It's a tough game. Dylan running in support. The Saints need to make inroads soon. Kelly fighting tooth and nail not to give up a goal. Their appeals have fallen on deaf ears. McKinnon wins it. They'll be sore in the morning. Dylan. She's gone. Zenos. It's there. It's always good for the confidence to see that first shot go through. The scoreboard suddenly looks more manageable. McKinnon wins it. Dylan. Suddenly there's some belief about them. Zenos. Kicks inside the forward 50. She's hit up the lead. Into the pocket she goes. Here's a big chance to peg back the margin. Straight in front, should not miss. Struck it well, no problems there. Great team goal. If they keep playing like that, they won't be behind for long. The Saints having a good patch. McKinnon showing her skills. She's caught. White. That's a bit of a gift. Just waiting for the right moment to press go. Veria at half back. Seth gives some ground with the handball. Got to get it going forward now. Up and under. The great Spud Frawley would have loved that one. Dylan. Well played. Her vision was excellent. Zenos. Bit of a nothing kick. Stanit went bang. Exxon met solidly. Guttridge closed her down. Zenos. Dylan. It's there. These defenders are going to have to tighten up. They've been giving them too much space. The Dockers really need to respond now. Great ruck work. East. She stopped in her tracks. McKinnon. Dylan. Crunching tackle. They've put themselves under pressure. Wheelstra can run and gun. Looking to extend this margin. Ty gets to the front spot. She hasn't looked like missing so far, so I'll back her in here. What a game she's having. She's drilled her fourth. Showing exactly why they want the ball in her hands. The Dockers have the edge, but they're in a scrap. Don't worry about that. McKinnon got her palm to it. This is a hotly contested footy. The Saints should score here. Stanit charges onto it. Can they find a late goal? Ty delivers to centre half forward. Honours the lead. Four straight so far today and kicking beautifully. Has she got enough on it? The Dockers have the edge at half-time, but this game is well and truly up for grabs.
It's time for some observations from Daniel Harford. The Dockers deserve to be two kicks in front. They could potentially have been further in front, but a few opportunities got away from them in the first half. They're playing a confident brand of footy and sticking to their game plan. As they typically do, they're effectively telling their opponents, you're going to have to play pretty well to beat us. Thanks for those observations, Half, as we get back underway. Big clearance to win here. White, Antonio, affects the turnover. On the spot to lay the tackle. This should end in a shot at goal. Punched away, Runnels. For a three-goal game, it's there. They've pinched a break. They might want to tighten up on her. They gave her too much space on that occasion, and she made the most of it. The Dockers with the break now. McKinnon gets her hand to it. White absorbs the pressure. Patrikios. She had prior opportunity. I've liked her game today. Punched away. McDonald loves the hard stuff. Terrific tackle, and we'll do it all again. McKinnon has rucked tirelessly. White read it well. McDonald. A good kick here and they'll be in business. No one can mark. Seth. It's a hot footy. Umpire says she had no prior. Wheelstra palmed it down beautifully. Bowers. How will the umpire see this? East. Runnels has found some space. Heads towards the half forward flank. No one can mark. Daniel, what have you noticed down at ground level? The Saints aren't getting much value out of their clearance dominance, and that could be very deflating. McKinnon, the winner there. East, she's set upon. Bowers, Aaron handball, and they've turned it over. White, under pressure. Friend, Vesely, great vision there. McKinnon, McDonald. Finally, they go inside 50. Pugh, belts it clear. Nolda, does the crumbing. It's a goal. They've got to find a way to get her into the game. We know how damaging she can be. The Dockers by seven points. McKinnon wins the tap. Dylan, that's a bruising tackle. Vesely, White, she'll certainly feel that one. She's under close attention. Squeezes the kick. She's wrapped up. We've got a whistle, umpire's ball. McKinnon palmed it down beautifully. Low. She's drawn a crowd. Neither side able to clear the footy. McKinnon, the winner there. Vesely. Dylan, that's skillful. Not the required 15 metres. The defenders will be nervous. Zenos. She can sense a goal from a long way off, but the kick is astray. Well, that was a promising build-up and deserved a better finish. Back into play. Pew working hard and presenting well. And they're away. Good thinking and good execution too. Moving the football laterally. Seth. Towards half forward with the kick. Wheelstra. Veria. Heads for the pocket. She's plucked it and she should have a shot. She's not on the board yet. That should change here. Looks good. She steered it through. Terrific goal there. She's so dangerous in front of the sticks. Two goal game again. Strom palmed it down beautifully. Miller cops some unwanted attention. Antonio, they're moving the football well here. The Dockers are bringing great energy. Vesely. No easy exit. Good hands. Low leads her opponent. Couldn't burst through. That's disappointing play. The Saints might be able to start something. Quality delivery by foot. Towards the boundary line. Nolder. Here's the vital kick inside the 50. Punched away. Zenos leading from the front. It's a goal. Neither team is able to string goals together or generate any meaningful momentum. It's an engrossing battle. Neither side giving an inch. What a contest we're seeing. Important clearance here. Miller. She's run into trouble. Bowers. Knew the tackle was coming. They're going nowhere and we'll have a stoppage near the centre. Strom. The winner there. White. 
Kicks inside the forward 50. She'll draw them level if she's accurate. She's goalless so far, but this would be a great way to get on the score sheet. Needs it to bend back, but it's not going to. Accuracy in front of goal is so important, particularly in a close game. Cuthbertson to bring it in. Franklin has charged into space. Verrier. Seth. No one can mark. Nolder. Zenos on centre wing has marked. Seth belts it clear. Franklin. No one can mark. Wheelstra knew where the help was. Bowers. Good penetration on the kick. Friend saves the day. Brings it out wide. McDonald with a chance to relieve the pressure. Can they get something going? Jacobson gives the handball away. She'll be sore tomorrow. She bit off more than she could chew. Low. Webb can run and carry. The Dockers looking ominous. That is great football. Fitzpatrick went bang. Lots to analyse, Daniel. What stands out? The Saints are doing a lot right, and they've got great belief they can win this match. The longer they stay close, the more that belief will grow. White, friend, a chance to clear now. Zenos, Nolder. Shearlaw goes back with the handball. Jacobson, they've got them on the overlap. Stannett went bang. Who will stand under that? Punched away. White might look to centre this. It's the umpire's ball as we near three-quarter time. Strom wins it. East, low. She's besieged. Keeps it low. That's good vision. Miller belts it clear. White, they might need to tag her. It's there. They were looking likely to score for a little while and finally they've found a way through. The Saints are really taking it to them today. Nolda is giving her a bit of a bath. Exxon, it's no place for the faint-hearted. The forwards have been starved lately. Can they make the most of this? Ott, attracted a crowd. Does well under pressure. Nolda. Anderson. She's had little impact so far. It looks a well-oiled forward line. Must kick goal in a close match. They like it behind the goals. She's got it. They've risen to the challenge and are playing inspired football. The Saints are taking it right up to their more fancied opponents. Strom wins it out of the centre. Exxon, they'll be sore in the morning. Dylan, it's a tough game. There's an argument for a free kick there. McKinnon has been dominant in the ruck. This is great pressure footy. She's done brilliantly. Riser. This will be another one. They can do no wrong. Typical small forwards goal there. She's a real live wire inside 50. They'll take a handy margin into three-quarter time. They're going to be hard to beat from here. Strom showing her skills. They've got good chemistry, those two. Looking to peg one back. Ott wins the contest and can relieve the pressure. Three-quarter time and an upset is brewing. How's your tipping going? Time for some more insights from half on the boundary. The Dockers are really struggling to score so far, and the simple reason is they're not winning enough ball. They would need to be super efficient with the ball that they are getting, but it isn't sustainable. Whether technically they try something different at stoppages or they throw someone different into the middle, they've got to do something. I'm inclined to agree. Thanks, half.
Strom punches it out of the ruck. Exxon, long ball in. Who's front and centre? Shearlaw with an opportunity. She won't be happy with that one. The Saints are finishing with a wet sail. Riser marks and should goal. To extend the margin beyond three goals. Heads goalward and she's off target. Missed one she should have got and let them off the hook. Back into play. Good work rate. The Dockers have been gallant. Runnels. Bowers kicks laterally. See something she likes. This is great ball movement. She's caught. Runnels. They've got time to put the kettle on. Friend takes a potentially goal-saving mark on the last line of defence. Into the middle with the kick. That's an impressive mark. Jacobson. McKinnon. Who is she aiming for? Lowe accepted the invitation. Can they keep the footy this time? Disappointing footy there. I don't think she'll remonstrate over that one. It's a high ball. Runnels belts it clear and will have a throw in. The Dockers are getting hammered in the clearances. They have to find a way to at least break even. Great ruck work. White, Smith. She hasn't been herself today. Franklin belts it clear. Jacobson sets a task for the forwards. Thumped away. The umpire will toss it back once more. Half what's caught your eye. The Saints are winning the clearances and contested ball. But they're also using the ball better, so it's no wonder the scoreboard's looking so good for them. Bowers. Stannett takes the short option. Miller. The clock is the enemy now. Strom. Franklin. Good handball. Navigated the traffic. East. They've given it back. Not sure who that was meant for, but it's been picked off. Bowers. It's a goal! Their efficiency in front of the sticks has arguably kept them in this game. The Dockers have the first of the last quarter. Strom got her palm to it. Exxon. She'll certainly feel that one. Goes long. Not her finest moment. Goes wide with the kick. Stannett has found some space. Can she find a teammate? Strom gets to the front spot. Kicks to the centre wing. Goes laterally. Webb. Ignoring the corridor for now. They'll bide their time. Keen to get the ball moving. Lost her radar there. She doesn't waste many. Good thinking and good execution too. Smith. Delivers it inside 50. Riser wins the contest hands down. Sometimes taking these half chances can make all the difference. The distance is the only problem. Strom may have just saved a goal. What can they generate? Honours the lead. Some indirect ball movement here. The Dockers are out of trouble. Runnels. Wheelstra. They've picked their way through. As Dennis would say, that kick was centimetre perfect. I wouldn't put this past her. I've seen her do it before. She struck it well. We'll go close. Strom has bobbed up. It's so important to be efficient in front of goal, particularly when it's tight on the scoreboard. It's there. They had to be patient, but they were able to pick their way through and eventually score. The Saints haven't quite put this to bed yet. Strom wins the tap. Exxon, she's wrapped up. White, that sloppy play and it could come back to bite them. Miller, the Dockers look to be coming home strong. Punched away. Friend, conservative kick. Anderson, and they're out of trouble. Not often you see a forward spoiling the ball. 
McDonald is a real pocket rocket. Cops some unwanted attention. Dylan, Exxon, throws it on the boot. Quality delivery by foot. That's an aggressive handball. I think she called for that. Gives it everything. Punched away. Anderson. Terrific forward pressure. This will be coming back. It's out on the full. The Dockers finishing strongly. Tie. This will be a goal and we have a new leader. She managed to find some space in a dangerous position and made them pay for their loose checking. We've got a great contest. Hope you're enjoying it at home. Big clearance to win here. Dylan, she's set upon. White. They want ball there, but they're not going to get it. Strom with the tap. Got to get rid of it. Drives it inside the forward 50. Time for the Crummers to go to work. Guttridge. It's a desperate tackle. It's a goal. They've got to limit her space. She's just reminded us all how dangerous she is when she gets loose. Neither team deserves to lose and perhaps neither will. McKinnon has had her measure today. Dylan made the footy hers. Rue read that one right off the boot. Delightfully done. Miller, clever kick. Antonio in the middle. Doesn't often waste it. Gore at half forward. Who's at home? It's a mark. She can go back and potentially win them the match. She'll give them the lead if she can hold her nerve. Tries to bend this one through, but it's unsuccessful. One behind. Nothing wrong with having a go, but it might have been a better option to set that one up to the top of the square. They're just about there. What can they muster from the back half? Normally delivers. White. Searching kick. Smith. See something she likes. Whatever she's suffering from, it's not leather poisoning. Strong grab. Takes a beauty. They've moved it well and given themselves a good look here. This would put the issue beyond doubt. Kelly heads for goal and that surely is the ball game. Surely that's shut the game on them. They will be very hard to beat from here. McKinnon is giving her a bit of a bath. White, she'll be sore tomorrow. And she's done for holding the ball. Can she hit a target? Bowers. Greg Williams would have been proud of that one. Got to go quickly. Time running out. Thumped away. White. McKinnon. Quick kick towards centre half forward. Seth belts it clear. McDonald has a paddock in front of her. Fighting tooth and nail not to give up a goal. Her field kicking is normally first rate. Well, they've managed to get the points, but not without a scare. On behalf of Kelly Underwood and Daniel Harford, I'm Jason Bennett. Thanks so much for your company. Hope to have you with us again next time. Oh, my God.